<laughs> now I'll be famous on the internet. Level up. Well, it's not the cock of the great shock. Shock. Sorry. Um, the f did you do? No, no, I'm cool. I'm cool. Um, I have some choices to make here, obviously. Mm, I see. You moved your pawn forward to attack the knight. And now my knight is in danger. He must run. But he does not run from danger. No, he is a knight. Yeah, but he's got nowhere else to go, so he's gonna run. Cause, you know, live to fight another day, all that. A lot of give and take. When you don't have a good option, you just pick the least worst one. I mean, obviously the, the, the queen is attacking the rook. So if I bring another couple strong pieces down there, it's, fucking, it's gonna look real bad. Mm -hmm. It's gonna look real bad. So you, what you wanna do is get a couple strong pieces to back your shit up. What we're talking about here really is a question of character. You know, are you the type of person to run from a fight, or are you the type of person to charge ahead? I'm a good gesture, Sten Mao. We don't stop on Rady. Charlie and Nam, I'm Kobasinse. I just told Charlie that I don't have any sausages. Done it. <gasps> I've just improved. <laughs> well, now I'll be famous on the internet. Okay, okay. So basically the rest of this uh, day, for some reason, my microphone on my phone no longer worked. So I will be narrating this. Um... At this point, I'm starting to have a uh, kind of a claustrophobic panic attack, and uh, everyone seems to not be taking it too seriously, which is, you know, perfectly normal. And uh, <clears throat> because you know, I'm kind of overreacting to the elevator situation. It was way funnier than than that. Uh, here, I'm sitting in the car waiting for Milan. We are going to go to a Chinese store. They call it the China Stores. And, uh, you know, I'm just kind of getting excited for that. Here we've arrived at the Chinese store, and I'm, I'm taking a lot of really great kind of candid shots and walking around and filming, filming stuff that's in the Chinese store and people and, and the, the entire Chinese store experience. Um, as you can see, I am overjoyed and, and cannot believe my luck that we get to uh, witness such a wonderful outing. Uh, I think at this point I remark that the entire... Oh yeah, I remember this guy. Th th this was a stuffed tiger that had like really sharp teeth. It was like crazy sharp teeth for like a, a plush toy. So I was just thinking like, you know, that's that's crazy. Like why would you buy a big fluffy stuffed tiger? Only to have, like, you know, crazy sharp teeth. I think at this point in the story, I, I found these plastic balls, which are like ball pit balls. But they had them strung together like these, like, giant anal beads. So I made a bunch of anal bead jokes here. Um, they were very funny, and, and everybody really, really laughed. And by everybody, I mean nobody was really standing around me. So, you know, it was a non-event to everyone else. But, you know, I thought it was pretty funny. What else happened? Eh, more meandering through the store. I think we were looking at wigs or something like that. Um, oh yeah, there was this jewelry box that made like this crazy clicking sound. And it just felt so cheap and, and retarded that I was just like, Oh, look at this crazy expensive clicking box. You can tell how expensive it is by the wild clicking sound. And um, man, I really come up with some great jokes sometimes. And, and other times I, I don't. That was the Chinese store uh, experience. Then we picked up, uh, uh, then we picked up this girl who's like, I guess, Yasser's makeup artist and uh, friend. And we went to a place to shoot a video. The place is called The Churge. And then I was going to do like a, 
like a montage here. So en enjoy this this montage. I know, right? It was it was so cool of me to do that. It was actually a really pretty place to, to shoot a uh, music video and stuff. And so, you know, sometimes you you get to you get to stand on top of the mountain for a little while and, and feel lucky that you're there. Here we're hanging out with Milan, and I tell him, "Oh man, I I could really go for some chivape, which is like a a meal." you know like a like a like a tasty little chivape so milan was like yeah dude let's go get some chivape which is like these little um sausage thingies so we get to this chivape place and um and we get to the, okay so we get to this chivape place and i i, I purposefully kind of keep the camera on myself because i know people generally don't like being on camera and stuff but this chick behind the counter like totally was just like, I'm going to call the police if you keep filming. And rather than tell her, um, you know, to go die a slow, painful death, I just was like, okay, whatever. You know, you, you don't have to do that. <laughs> please, please don't call the police. No, no, I don't want to. I don't want to deal with it. And I was just like, whatever, dude. And then I left and I got my chivape, which looks like this. Um, they're like little snossages little meat snossages and uh and i ate them outside whilst filming of course no sound so you know you can't tell that, that there's no uh whatever yasser's behind me he's like crossing his arms because he's just like dude um don't make scenes you know that's his thing he's like because like you know i'm a pretty loud guy and I, i'll make a scene every now and again uh, what the hell's going on here? Oh yeah, we're still eating. I'm finishing off the chivopper, and Milan and I are walking back to the car, and he's like, dude, that lady's just a dick, and I was like, whatever, man, I'm already over it. Like, people that, like, yell at me, they're like, you know, whatever, I'm over them. You know, I was trying to make him feel better, but I, I guess, I don't know, whatever. That, that's the situation there. And then here we're, like, in his car, and I'm just kind of like, yeah, let's go home. Oh, that's when I realized... That moment right there is when I realized that there was no sound in all my previous interactions for the day. So I was just kind of like, what? But anyway, that's that. Subscribe if you haven't already. me on Instagram. Instagram. Gradual report. And on Facebook. If you have a Facebook, then on Facebook. And we'll see you tomorrow. Ajde, ljubim te. Mwah!